Oh my fucking god! I am glowing! Why am I so fucking bright? Why? I don't know why! Holy shitballs! As you guys can see, I'm on my new laptop over here. This thing is fucking gigantic. I just rendered a RuneScape video and it took me literally, uh, I think like not even nine minutes. It, the total time was like 8.40, so yeah, not even nine minutes. Uh, normally on my old laptop it would be about 40, 50 minutes. On my desktop it would probably take about 20. So yeah, this laptop is fucking awesome. The only thing I'm regretting is right now I look kind of like a fucking ghost, but that could probably be changed, will be changed for tomorrow. Uh, and USB ports are kind of all over the place. If you guys watched my, uh, unboxing video, I have one USB port over here, one over here, uh, two behind. It, it used to be on my other laptop, it would just be two, two in a row over here so I could plug my headset in, my mic, I mean my headset and mouse. <laughs> then on this side I could plug in anything else. So, oh, tiddly shit though. But this thing is fucking awesome. Not to mention one thing about this that is different than a lot of other laptops is that usually the fan, I'd say on 99% of laptops, is on the bottom. So that's why a lot of people, their laptop would overheat because the fan was always on the bottom and they would put it on their bed like I used to. You know, not my old laptop, my old, old laptop that you guys saw in PvP 12, I believe. But... This laptop, the fan is on the side, so as I'm rendering a video and my CPU is working, uh, the fan starts, you know, pushing out some hot air. It's kind of like if your hand is cold, your hand gets a little, uh, a little, you know, warm sensation. <laughs> ah, anyways, let me see. Uh, last night, I rendered a video... Uh, was talking to some people on Skype, was playing RuneScape, uh, was fucking watching a YouTube video, and downloading some music. So, therefore, you would think that I would lag, my CPU did not even spike above 30%, which is pretty fucking amazing. So I am very happy. I'm a very happy person and happy beaver. Anyways, last night, I almost got to 96 mil fletching experience. That will be achieved tonight. Hooray! Uh, farming is going down slowly, as you guys can see. Uh, not to mention, Slayer is going down slowly. That's pretty much about it. Uh, I have a new RuneScape video on my main channel. Uh, if you guys haven't seen it from last night, it was basically one of those short little funny videos that I just found to be awesome to make. Annotation is in the bottom of the screen if you guys haven't uh, seen it already. Ah, there we go. I think I fixed the uh, little brightness problem. So, as you guys see, oh, it looks kind of better. So, therefore, I'm going with that. It's better. Anyways, as for tomorrow, um, have a fucking shit up video on main channel. And that's pretty much about it. Um, just really been fletching. As you guys know, uh, not really been doing too much. Uh, been flipping items, like, uh, the other day I, I flipped, uh, fucking some Dragon Claws, but really just want to stay away from shit still, because, I mean, yeah, summer is coming, but, I mean, if you look at last summer, things weren't as low as they were this summer, so my prediction for, like, summer's rise is that it's going to rise to what items used to be before they fucking crashed in the past couple months. So, what I mean by that is, like, for example, last last year, um, Dragon Claws were about at, I remember, like, 28 mil. Uh, then Summer uh, summer Rise happened, and um, they became, like, 36, 37. You know, it's, it would be around that much. But now, there's just... You got the absorb shit that affects Dragon Claws significantly. Because in my videos, as you guys saw... Motherfuckers have tried to declaw rush me, and they cannot. Mainly because, well, the absorb actually really does help. So the absorb, um, AGSs are just really fucking low in price. I, I saw someone selling a whip the other day in World Two for nine hundred and fifty k. That that's pretty fucking sad if you really think about it. Because I remember buying my first whip for three point two mil. 
And I mean, it was just it was just pretty awesome, you know. And yeah, it's because people are losing them in PvP. So technically, you could go into PvP with a Dragon Scimitar that's worth absolute butthole shit, and you could PK a whip. And then hey, guess what? You no longer have to fucking buy a whip. You could just keep it, or you could sell a whip if you think about it. But from what I hear, I have. Uh, quite a few friends with a uh, high slayer level and they they said that uh, when they get Abby demons for a task they actually get a couple whips and a lot of you guys have been writing me uh, this shit because you guys are like oh my god I go to Abby demons and I get a couple whips it's basically Jagex gives you a couple whips because they understand whips are worth shit and you know, you would go to Abbey Demons about a year ago, you would maybe get one whip, which was maybe like fucking three mil back then still. Now you go to Abbey Demons, you get like three whips, that's equal to about three mil if you think about it. So, it's re it really equals itself out. Like a friend of mine went to, um, uh, was doing a Slayer task, uh, Dark Beast, or, uh, yeah, I think, I'm pretty sure it's Dark Beast. <laughs> uh, he got, uh, fucking four, uh, Dark Bows. So he made over two, I, like, I think they're like 600k each, or there might be 700k. Hey, he made over two mil, but if he had done that shit a year ago, he probably would have only gotten one Dark Bow because it would have been worth maybe like 1.5 mil. So things are really going to equal out, kind of. Um, I don't fish in the fishing guild anymore, but from what I hear is that you can actually catch sharks faster now. Since sharks used to be like 1200 each, then you could only make like 180k an hour. But since sharks are 500 each, you can only make like fucking technically I, not even 100k an hour. So therefore, Jagex has to speed up some shit if you think about it. Um, now, this could just be, you know, rumors. Like I said, I haven't fished sharks in probably about over a year. And I don't want to. I really don't. If Jagex, for whatever reason, reset my fishing to one, I would be forced to fish sharks, but I would not like it. Oh, tiddly shit. Anyways, um, what the hell? Oh, yes. I saw a funny comment yesterday, but I cannot find it again. Uh, it was a bobbing for cock thing, as I told you guys last night. And, uh, somebody said they bobbed for cock, and they hit their head on their fucking keyboard and had to get stitches. I'm not even sure if that's possible because I've hit my head on fucking walls on other people's heads before and I've never had to get stitches, but maybe if you hit it a certain way, then maybe that is possible. Anything is possible, damn it. We're talking about RuneScape. But otherwise, guys, as for tonight, I will be 96 mil fletching experience. That is fucking ownage. The hooba hooba mosh pits are getting closer and closer. Anyways, right now I want to go to my email address and we have some happy hooba hooba questions. Ask I'm at yahoo.com and I dream for me. You who's otherwise, well, fucking a lot of bad shit will happen. Like you may hit your head on your keyboard from bobbing from cock. For for bobbing to cock or from cock. I Bangkok! There we go. Ah, why would somebody name their fucking shit Bangkok? I got I have no clue. But anyways, first hooba hooba question. Hey, dude, I just wanted to know, honestly, have you ever bought it or real-world traded? Ours username, uh, Madison371. Uh, we've gone over this many times before, and there's really no evidence that I can show you guys that I haven't bought it. Oh, wait, yes, there, yes, there is evidence. My account has never been banned. My account has not been reset. And I'm pretty sure that there's a lot of small dick faggots that file false reports to my account every day, which makes Jagex monitor my account every day, so therefore, if they're monitoring my fucking account, then why haven't I been banned for botting? You see, it's just, it's common sense, you know? But as for real world trading, you guys know my policy on that. I have bills to pay, like fucking car insurance and other fucking shit. So therefore, spending cash for GP just really isn't my thing. If you guys want to waste your fucking paycheck that you probably earn doing whatever, then it's really up to you. I mean, the same thing with botting. I mean, botting is pretty much a risk to your account, but RuneScape will never stop botting ever. There will always be people botting on this game. So, yeah, that's pretty much about it. 
Next question. Hey, Nightmare R H. Just was wondering, why don't you make a video of yourself doing the Hooba Hooba dance in real life? Um, I've tried to do it before, and it didn't come out very pretty. So therefore, I will practice, and I will do the Hooba Hooba dance in real life on video. But I need practice, that God damn it. I, I fucking kind of tripped over my own feet. It was pretty nasty. Anyways, guys, if you got anything for me, you can leave it in a nasty, dirty little comment. I will see you happy motherfuckers tomorrow, and bye!